Hello to everyone. So in this tutorial, I will show very, very quickly how to edit your move map list. It's simple, it's easy. So let's go into it. So we need at least one tool, which is Pentium Tools, or for season one and season three, episode one, and all the versions, we need MCTV version, blah, blah, blah. This is a new Sonic Tools. I will be leaving the link down in the description and also about this one. So. I'm gonna use an example of season three, season six, um, move list file, and we're just gonna go, just quickly on what is important to make the list work. All right, easy, chuck chuck, we'll do it. So open the Pentium tools, and open the BMD file that you like to open to edit, which is from your client. Uh, let's find it. Move rec editor. Then we go file open BMD and we find a client somewhere there. We go to local and there English and all this stuff because um, the version season five and higher version they created this update so they put some language on it. So we go to English, which is what we use probably. And we need to find move rec. Where is move rec here somewhere? Move rec underscore English BMD. Gonna do the same with the other BMD files. That means when you finish editing, just go back to the client and you will have like, you will have this move rec here edited. You just change it to SPN, which is Spanish. And you go to SPN and um, put it back there. So you don't need to do the work again. But yeah, that's it. So what we do now, what we do, what's important. Most important thing is the index. That means if our arena index is one and the index here is zero, then when you click in arena, it will not move you at all. The same thing uh, will apply to gate. If he has 50 and he has 51, it might move you somewhere else or it will not move you at all. So that's the simple thing that I want to explain. This is the index, which is one, two, three, four, five, blah, 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 blah. And this is also here, the index. Okay. Why they put 31, 32, 43, and they didn't put it one, two, three, four, five, blah, 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 blah until uh, like normal list, uh, numeral list, right? Because it doesn't matter, okay? If I put arena over here and I put arena, arena, and I put 50 level you need, and then you need, I don't know, 2K Zen, and you need 50, the gate is 50, then I remove this, I change this, okay? It will still work because the list is here, you know? The list is here. The map list will be, the arena will be down here for sure because you have to put it up here on the list. <laughs> but you're still gonna uh, move to correct map, which is gonna be one stadium, stadium, and will be 50, the gate, which is stadium, and the level you need is 200, and how much then you need 2000. So that was simple, that was easy to understand, I hope. Now, one thing is the name here on the client it's just a name right it will just display on the client so here it says stadium so it doesn't matter that means what you need to focus on if you put arena here and you want people to move by using arena then on this on the server side you should put arena as well because when they try to use the command uh, slash move arena it will not work, so they will need to put stadium. You understand? So that's the only thing I want to say about the names. The names doesn't matter, but it's better if they match together from the server side to the client side. So the second thing is we have like here minimum and max level. Max level. Um, let me reopen because it's crazy. Uh, minimum is a max level. Some most server file, most uh, client files, they don't have this kind of minimum max level. They just have level, but I think the editor does that. So doesn't matter. Actually, if you have two hundred for arena, 
then we uh, we just use 200 for both sides so it's gonna be 200 and maximum level 200 so 200 to 200 is the only level you can move there the zen is 2000 and here we need 2000 so remember one very very important thing okay if i put here 5000 then 2000 here it will say that you need 5000 but you actually need just 2000 so all the numbers here everything you see here except the gate and the index which is gate and index this index this is gate these two things are very important so you will be able to move to the map correctly that's it the rest are just visuals for the client in this file the bmd file that means if you just you know make a mistake and put 5000 zen here oh and then you see oh damn it uses like 200,000 zen then the, the issue is because on the server side it's not the same value that you put so yeah that that's it is like i said you can use any numbers you want like for the index you can put like i don't know 67 and it should be also here 67 then and yeah that's it it will read from here to here and that's how this, this thing works and yeah there are most uh, move rec files they have these free slots here so you can add your extra map moves like Vulcanos 2 or Karutan 3 or Lachlan 2 whatever and one thing I want to say is for Vulcanos you see I changed this to Vulcanos and not Volcanos the reason is the reason listen to reason now I figure out by uh, reading some posts the reason is Vulcanus is a battle map or something like that so you have to be in gens or something to move there but if you change the map name to Vulcanus which is very similar then everyone else could be uh, will be able to move there so this is it it's simple it's easy like I said index is the most important thing that you need to focus on and here you go to disable a map of showing on the server um, you just um, here and let's say I want to disable the refuge just put two sli slash slashes there slash lines and that's it they will not show I mean you will not be able to move there and to not be able to move there but also you don't have the map here right like if you say you have the map here it's 44 refuge refuge we need how much 200 level 150 50,000 actually sorry younger level 15,000 and gate is 257 so if I want to fix this and remove the map from here I just have to remove everything make it zero or something like that so you know it will not show anything at least boom that's it that's how you remove the maps and add maps yeah i hope this uh, helped you and um, there's more much much more to learn but if there are any questions just send me a message below on the comment section uh, ask on rage zone as always and you know we will talk probably on the next video about gate txt gate files how this thing works thank you again for watching i'm gonna leave the description um these tools here the links are for these tools and yeah you should try out all right guys good luck and i see you on the next video peace